one of the key components of understanding who you are for others is that we all are all frequency. And as you look down at your human design, the beautiful activations that you have on the conscious side of the body graph, the unconscious side of the body graph, these are who you are for others. And as you look down to see what channels, what strengths you have in your design, this is what you are designed to shine in this life. The sweetness of your success comes from the definition in the design. Now, when you walk around in this life and you experience the not-self theme of bitterness, that is a beautiful gift, my friends. It's not a curse. That bitterness shows us how we are here to recognize when we are not making decisions aligned with ourselves. The bitterness, the resentment even, deep frustration, potential anger or disappointment. Those are all signposts, like bumps on the side of the road that show you you are off track. So if you live your life in bitterness, don't worry, there's hope. Help is on the way. Because all you have to do is start to make decisions that you can trust through aligned interaction, waiting for recognition and invitation. Mutual recognition is a two-way street. That is our success secret, is that we're designed to recognize advisors who can recognize in order to bring others to success. And when you bring enough others to success, you get your own sweetness of success as well. Now, sweetness of success is not necessarily numbers in a bank account, although for those of us who have activations in the stream of capitalism, in the energy resource that bring profound wealth, or in the activations that are in the quarter of civilization, purpose fulfilled through form, where it is the domain of Lakshmi to be able to have profound wealth. Those of us who have that, it is a dollar sign, but no dollar sign can substitute for the sweetness of you being you. No dollar sign can substitute for the sweetness of you mastering your human environment. So I hope that in some way, I found a way to connect with you to help inspire you, as is my gift, channel of inspiration, design of a creative role model, or in some way convey or infect, contagiate you with my experience of discovering my own success secrets and my own sweetness in this life. Because having the sweetness of connecting with others in a way that is successful, not bitter, in a way that is sweet, not sour, but in a way that also maintains that you have the energy, i.e. money, to have your life be perfectly financed is such a gift. And that money, that dollar sign, that amount is different for all of us because all of us have a different path, a different way, a different level of understanding and connection to managing the resources of the tribe and the energy that empowers the, the individuals and the larger groups. So all of us are gonna have a different number bank account that feels sweet and successful. But it doesn't mean that it has to be a set amount, not that homogenized, oh, I'm a multimillionaire, I've made it. No, this is not about that. This is about the success that is you being that lighthouse for humanity, not for all of humanity, but just that one other person at a time, unless you are like myself for small groups, or unless you are like Serpa, as an example, for large groups, you are here to be an individual guide to humanity, whether you're here to be like Jeff, who is designed to be a leader of unexpected opportunities in life, whether you're designed to be like Anne, a guide of the Maya through the Maya, Maya to give strategies with emotional clarity, whether you're designed to be like Serpa explaining in order to empower, or Chris to support the tribe to accept the limitations of the form and to guide them to success through his judgment, 
or like Denise, who's designed to, again, empower large groups of people through her supportive emotional nature as a right angle cross of Eden. Yume, who is here to penetrate to the core of the intuitive truth, to be able to be a support system for her tribes and to be able to penetrate as a clarity of an individual knowing projector who can guide. Or like Jan, another right angle cross of contagion like myself, who is truly to be an influential leader as somebody who can infect or contagiate information through others, through transmission, role modeling, and being somebody who can abstractly communicate with certainty his inspirational thought process in order to fulfill his purpose through mind. Whether you're one of these or someone else I have yet to meet, I hope that you have found some kind of way of being inspired in this life to understand how you're here to be successful. Now let's go to questions. Let's see. And um, Taylor has the question, I have the channel of structuring and I feel like I have a hard time articulating the thoughts and knowings I have. I'm trying very hard to follow my authority and wait for the invitation to share. Wondering what centers and channels I'd, I, would, I should look for the way I effectively communicate. Good question, Taylor. So without looking at your design, I can't fully answer that question in the way I would in our um, live mentoring classes like I will on Thursday. But all you have to do is look down at the body graph. Everyone look down at your communication and action function, the throat center. And I want you to see what channels you have, if any. If you do not have a channel, then you do not have a consistent way of speaking, acting, or communicating. If you do have a channel like myself, that is your consistent way. So you look at those two channels, you find the available planetary activations. So as an example, you would look to see which one of them are going to be how you're here to communicate. So you can see that my earth, what grounds me is being a teacher because that is how I'm here to fulfill my life's work. That is a teacher line, fifth line, gate eight, the teacher contribution as an individual process that holds a group together in a unique and empowered way. And then also what's my personal unconscious law and protection is that I have a, a gate eight again, but line two, and is that it is the willingness to be an example for a price. So the price that I have to pay in being an example of a creative role model who is here to infect you with my contagious energy of empowerment, I'm designed to be unconsciously driven to creatively explain things in a unique way. So that's my consistent way. Now, you're going to look at your channels and that's your consistent way. And then you're going to look at any gate activations. So for those of you who have gate activations, but no channels, then you're going to have this center undefined. It's not going to be colored in like mine. What's creating the colored in activation is the channel. The channels are the life force in the design. Your life force energy is consistent and fixed. It's uniquely specialized. It's highly individuated. It's not replicated anywhere else on this planet, my friends. This is who you are. This is how you're here to communicate. 